Welcome back to Snipe City Cards, everyone. We've got an update on our 2016-17 uh, video for the Cup. We opened a box of 16-17, the Cup, I would say about a month and a half ago. And uh, we got a Mitch Marner expired redemption for a limited logos number to 25. If you didn't see the original video, we will post a link in the description. Um... That's basically the gist of it. This was definitely the take of the box. It was probably a case hit. And uh, it is expired. So we had to just go through the process. We called Upper Deck. Uh, they told us they don't have the card on hand anymore. They originally told us it was destroyed, which they changed uh, that story a bit later. We'll get to that. Uh, but they basically told us you got to send it to the expired redemption raffle program. So we did. And here is our replacement card. Excited to see what's in here. All right, let's see what we have. We have an auto rookie patch of, it looks like Anthony Mantha. Uh, all right, from the Exquisite Collection which is the same year that Mitch Marner is. So that's fun. Um, and we got the generic letter from Upper Deck, which thanks us for being in the program. So this is what I thought was going to happen. Um, so it was Chris that bought this box. This is not an adequate replacement for that Mitch Marner card. Um, looked it up. At best, it's 200 bucks. The comps, like these, these two cards here sold for under 200 and... This was right after he got traded to Washington. He scored four goals in his first four games. He had a four-game goal streak. So, I don't know. This uh, this is a miss from Upper Deck. Um, the last Mitch Marner limited logos info I can find is on PWCC from January of 2019. It sold for $813. But we do see one puttering around on eBay. It's not on right now, but I've seen it coming on and off. It's in about 2500 to five thousand dollar price range uh we did email upper deck to basically say hey i thought old cards were destroyed you sent us a 1617 mantha that's the same year and the card isn't even worth 250 dollars which is the highest tier that we're supposed to be in this box cost 2500 dollars and like you know aside from that marner card you got maybe 150 bucks back out of the box uh, so there is a problem with the Upper Deck uh, Redemption or Expired Redemption tiered program. The fact that they still sell expired redem or boxes that have expired redemption cards in there for thousands, and yet the highest valued tier is two hundred and fifty dollars plus, is a bit of a miss. It's they do say buyer beware, but honestly, like for collectors, this isn't good enough. It's not a bad card. It's just simply not good enough. But let us know what you guys think in the comment section, and as always, thanks for watching.